us in Cav over Monday. And I've been wanting to do this skin for a long time. And I finally just forced myself to do it today. Uh, well, Sunday is when I did it. But uh, it's the Mayflower skin for the with the draw mat on. And what's funny is this darn thing, just like with the Atlas van lines, the drum box paint's really funny. So it looks dark here, but as soon as the sun comes out, it might look lighter than the truck. It's just a relax, reflex, oh boy, reflectivity of the paint somehow. But uh, yeah, I kind of like it. And um, I had left the front. I didn't really find this exact trailer paint job on a K100. But uh, the trailer, this skin comes with the trailer, sort of. I've completely redone it on my own version of the trailer. So it's all brand new text. It's in the same place. It's the same stuff. Um, other than a couple fonts. Uh, the Mayflower.ca font. I couldn't find the one he was using. And it was so pixelated and messy. I just redid it. I put a different caution sticker on the back for the wide turn. As I didn't find the one they had. I put a new Kentucky logo on Kentucky trailer on uh, change that we did the script of course in the back the colors the small script the boat I redrew the boats from scratch and put them on the truck so we did the 53 foot thing that's new well the whole thing anyway but it looks much better it's more crisp and um, the other one was looking a little you know, next to the truck paint, it didn't look too good. I still have to fix the yellow across the front of the trailer. It's off by a few pixels. But, I mean, it's my own... It, I, the skin comes in the mod, so I don't know how I'm going to share that with anybody. But um, maybe I can get a hold of the mod author and see if he minds if I update his skin. Anyway, we'll, uh, let's get with it. We're in... Uh, Everett, Washington, and we're going to Osiris, British Columbia. And in that it's, uh, I didn't put the Canada on the thing. That's just the way the skin is. It comes with the trailer, so I just did it. And so we're going to go to a Canadian location. Uh, they start on CA. Move north and start moving Alberta. Cool. Let's, uh, oh, wait a minute. What have we got the yard? back there. Oh, looks like we might be able to get out up there okay. Alright. Yeah, a couple other things. Uh, once again, we got snow, snowy moon going. I've got the... Um, I updated the computer, of course. I don't have the frame counter running because that concrete there. Oh, that's across the street up there. That isn't... Oh, that's another way out, isn't it? What? what? Oh, that's another yard. Cool. I guess maybe what we should do is go this way. We could probably go out there. So I'm using the... Uh, just installed my... I have no experience with it. Just started using it. The Zmods audio framework. Gotta kind of find out what that's about as we go here. And I'm using an engine I hardly ever used. And that's Zmods N14. My headset volume way down. Let's see how that is. Oh. Yeah, it might be loud enough. Oh, it's not too loud. Sounds like you're right on top of the uh, intake wonder. If I turn the turbo down, 
Will that change that? Turbo is way down. Hmm. Let's try the ex... Or if that's the ex engine volume, let's try that. You usually have to move those sliders quick. I'll try it and see what happens. Hopefully it's not going to ruin the video. Yeah, we'll see what happens when the sun comes up. Uh, the colors of the drum add-on change. I must have wasted an hour today looking for fun to do the, uh, the URL for the company on the trailer. Maybe even more. Just couldn't find anything. I'm sure it's out there, but I wasn't finding it. I just uh, felt I was wasting a bunch of time, so I just moved on. And it may be something I can't share anyway, so... Or sorry for the truck that matched the skins for the trailer. I think it all of the guy who made the mod for the trailer and see if he would mind if I just redid all the skins. his way. Oh, I had the windows down too, just because the uh, glass on this truck isn't great. Nice if somebody have updated. truck in uh, the live stream on Saturday, and, uh, this engine, sorry, and folks thought it sounded okay, so hopefully it's good here too. Boy, this is a great road. Wow. You know what we have to do? Look at the darn map and see where we are. Highway 2 to Wenatchee. Oh, I had to have been on this before. It just looks better because the graphics on the computer have changed. So that snowy moon dude went uh, pay where, like I say, paying a dollar a month for his uh, uh like a Patreon thing, a dollar a month to use it now. But it seems to be it's pretty good. But the uh, 
uh, log train mod in here. That would be really cool. And this delivery is urgent. We're going 35 miles an hour following this bulk feed truck. That's not good. Must be a long train. It's still here. This uh, DLC is, this is uh, one of the originals. settings off. I'm getting that broken sort of weird looking effect on the screen. Well, that's quite a road. You have to wonder if I've ever been on this road. Man, it's just not ringing a bell. Shame on me if I have it. Convoy because uh, it's got such a deep and low sort of muted sound that it's uh, really easy to hear conversation. Oh man, this. this is really good for a really old DLC. Now the guy's going. I guess it just doesn't want to be passed. I notice that sometimes with uh, traffic. Sometimes uh, get you all silos up, lined up for a pass. Yeah, ready, get out there and start going. And they just waltz off into the distance. Oh, 
Okay, I gotta look at the map again here. Sorry about this. I just gotta be clear of where we were. So I've been on that road before. Oh, I've been to here. So I've been up here and over here. I just don't remember that highway too. That was a really nice drive. Dang it. That weird fact that won't be Jack, I'm uh, sorry guys, I'm just jumping all over the place on you. Is there something weird here with why is it doing that? You're supposed to have the anti aliasing aliasing turned on, the vertical sink. I gotta turn it back on. Just to see if that's what the problem is. I can't remember. <laughs> I know there's something you have to have turned on for the stowing. Well, that looks better. Might have been the problem. It looks much better, too. the windshield anymore. The whole garage hit one at you, I think it is. Got to work on that mod that Jab J A B uh, his um, mod that he has where you can customize your home garages. I'm gonna do one up for our trucking VTC or our ATS VTC. I don't know. I think trucking it's redundant, isn't it? It's, it's it's not a car driving VTC. That would be a VCC. VTC stands for Virtual Trucking Company. So that vertical sink, uh, turning that back on made a difference. The colors look good. Turn the frame counter off again because it's locked on. 60. I wanted to do a delivery to from Canada down to Recon's furniture delivery place in Spokane, but I couldn't find one from Promods Canada anywhere, and I don't know why that is. That's just the way it is, or there's something has to be done to make that work up there. So, we just got a furniture delivery. Uh, delivery going to um, the winery in the Soyuz. It's just kind of cool. I might go in there. It's been quite a while since I've been to it. Those little 
picking things on the side of the road, the uh, shoulder markers, they do a lot of damage when you hit them with the truck. They're... They're deadly. She's kind of weird. But they end. I mean, the car runs into you and it'll turn you over, so... <laughs> yeah... Everybody's carrying kryptonite, and we're not. We don't have our anti-kryptonite, whatever it would be. Side here. Well, I don't know if we heard it right there. Maybe notice some more of it going slower. I'll move around the truck. And you, if you're wearing headsets, a headset, or you have good stereo, you'll hear it. The effect change. something on the road. Something invisible. That's not a double yellow, but boy, he's going slow. This is an urgent delivery. What's the worst that could happen? Oh no! Okay. Back in the dang truck! 
Oh, what was I thinking? <sighs> I guess it's going slow enough to give it a whirl, but the old drive, oh, the old drive right there. Has that puff of smoke coming out, diesel. No one does it. Yeah, she's a long train. This guy behind me is going, well, why did you go and pass me for it? Look at us now. Yeah, that, that uh, box isn't lighting up too much. I guess I'm going to have to try and lighten the shade. You know what I'm going to do, guys? I might. I don't get a chance on Sunday night to finish the skin. I'll have to do it on Monday. I apologize for that, but I'd like to get it a little better than it is. Almost there. Keep your shirt on. And hurry up. <laughs> fire truck is going to put the fire out. The guy's hair dude that's got his hair on fire. What the delivery? Let's see. Let's hop out so you can see this little more 
are this little there's won't winers up on the hill over there. Gotta go across this little bridge up here. Boy, it's a game we look good. Wow. That is crazy. Got a bridge. I just had to jump out and get a photo where it was just too good to pass up. Beautiful spot. Right up here on the right. on the truck to match the top of the trailer. Do that. Add it to the list of things to fix up. And here we are, beautiful British Columbia. Uh, look at that. Look at the graphics. God dang. These things never look so good. Wow. All right. Else's. Oh, don't have a horn. No horn. Oh, that is weird. We got four ways. Yeah. Well, that was weird. I don't want to pull my horn. I've got no horn. Some people might say I'm always blowing my own horn. I have to tell the old gal that's the story. Oh yeah, um, shoot, late to announce. I'll have to say it again tomorrow for those that skip out of the video. Um, I'm not going to do Call Them All Mondays anymore. I'm just going to do VW Mondays. Because part of doing Call Them All Monday was I just love driving for doubles. And I wanted an opportunity to do it more. So I, and I really intrigued with that guy, uh, Matt, his, his work. And I thought I would do Call Them All Sunday and get lots of opportunity to drive doubles, But... I thought, well, now that's kind of run its course. It's time to do just B double Sundays, rather. And I'll have an opportunity to drive all kinds of B doubles. Like, you know, uh, pneumatic trailers. And, you know, there's that logging trailer now I have. And uh, there's the box vans. All kinds of stuff. We'll probably find something we haven't even looked at before. But anyway, oh. Yeah, the white doesn't look super bad right there in that light. Oh god, this camera. Stop it. Let's do a little zero thing here. Oops, won't go that far. Slow it down. See, at a certain light, it doesn't look terrible. And the uh, yellow of the stripe is way darker than that on the drawing. 
It's just funny how that thing paints. But yeah. Now we'll see what I got going tonight. Maybe I can finish this on Sunday night and get it out. But, uh, yeah, I, I kind of like it. I was been meaning to do it for about a year and a half. <laughs> so that's me. It's always late. Always late. A day late, a dollar short. But anyway, as always, guys, really appreciate you following along. And uh, we'll catch you on the next one. Take care and bye for now.